club league is a great way to stimulate activity in your club and get to know your players. Now, players will usually be added in pools and uh, often four to five players within a pool. All of the players in one pool play against each other within a certain period of time, let's say that it's a month. To create the club league, click on the create button at the top of the website and select club leagues from the submenu. Then at the end, just click the create button in the pop-up that appears. In this page, you enter the basic information about the club league. Now, the first that thing that you want to do is add the name of it. I'll just name this one as Rankton Squash League. Under the name, you can connect the ranking to it and uh, you can find actually a link within the description how to create it. Adding a ranking is optional, but it's still a good practice. And uh, as an addition, if you don't connect the ranking to the club league, players won't get any points for their final standing positions. Next settings are for player movement. The first one, promote demote player per round, is for promoting and demoting the players at the end of each round. Now, if you select promote and demote on one pool player, in the end of the round, the first player from the pool goes in the upper better ranked pool, and the last player from the pool goes down in the lower ranked pool. Skip round position drop option is for players actually that didn't join within the current round. So, if it is selected one place down when the round finishes, the players that missed the round and have played in it actually are going to be dropping one position lower. And uh, if they join in within the next round, they'll just start one position lower than the previously played one. Now, next that you want to do is choose a location. You can use the Google Auto Fill or you can enter the location fields manually. The club league can be set as a period of time, so you should just set a start and end date. This can also be done uh, everything like within a single day, which means that all of the matches will be played in one day. In the next section, you'll need to add a club league regulation, and of course this is optional, but it's always a good practice to do it. The next two options, uh, match type and age group, are defined within the ranking group where the players from the club league can be found after finishing it. In the pool settings, you set the number of pools and players per pool. Now, for example, if you have 24 players, you set 6 pools with 4 players per pool. In the advanced settings, you set the rule for generating the final standing for each pool. And uh, after filling in the necessary fields, you can create the club league by clicking the create button. In this page, you can add sponsors logo and uh, I'll just skip this for now. We move to the next step, players. An admin can add the players manually from this page or the players can join manually by clicking the join button within their event home. I'll just add some players so I can show you the next steps. After adding the players, you can uh, manually seed them within their appropriate pool. Uh, you can also change the pool size from this drop down here. Don't forget to click the update button once done. You can close the sign in now and start the club league. Players are now notified by email that the club league has started. Let's go to the event home and see how it looks like. In the pool section you can preview the pools and you can enter results for every player. The practice for a club league is the players to enter results by themselves. Now they can find their matches within their profile pages and enter the results from that section. After entering the result, the opponent needs to confirm it. An admin finishes off the round at the end date set in the first step and all of the players that have played at least one match will get points within the ranking. To finish the round and create the next one, you go to the event manager and uh, in the fifth step, click finish current round and create the next round. You can find the club league by typing the name of it within the search bar and selecting it from the event results. If you need any help, just contact us and uh, our support team will be happy to assist you. See you within the next tutorial.